Brian Helgeland, welcome to the show. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, and thank you so much for bringing legend to us. What's a, what's a, a nice Hollywood veteran like you doing with a British story like this, an East End gangster story? I always wanted to do a gangster film, and I think in the United States, so if you did an Italian mafia New York film, you're really asking for trouble, I think. <laughs> you're dead from the start because of all the films that have gone on before. When, when did you reach the decision, or, or, or was that one of the, the first things in place that Tom Hardy would be doing both the craze? The craze were twins, and there's a tradition of one actor playing both twins. And I, I was curious about going that way, but I was afraid it might become a gimmick and that we, had, we, we would unfortunately find out if it didn't work months later that we had ruined the film from the start. So because Reggie is the lead in the film, I, I thought I'll cast Reggie first and take it from there. And I sent it to Tom, who I, had, I didn't know him, but I had seen him in his film Warrior that he did. And I thought there was a Reggie Cray element to that character. And he read it, and we had dinner. And from the moment he sat down, all he spoke about was Ron. And it was very quickly obvious that he wanted to play Ron. And to the point where he was saying, "Pass us." He was he took on Ron's voice already. He passed the salt in Ron's voice, you know, to be funny. But uh, I thought, uh, how, how am I going to work this? And he knew I wanted him to play Reggie. <laughs> And at the end of the dinner, he basically said, I'll give you Reggie if you give me Ron. So we kind of handed, <laughs> handed over. And then that was the big decision of the film right there is that he's going to play both of them.